What's up guys, it's Ivesheda99 here and today we will be playing the Batman Telltale series episode 3 New World Order now, It's been a while since I've done since I've done a video on this and, and the reason is because I've been doing for a lot of real life stuff like during the first week of April my, my dad was but well, my boyfriend was uh, came to visit me in England which that was a really good that was a really good time. In, in the past two weeks during this month it's a bit, it, my dad's had luck has been quite ill so, so so I couldn't really record but like like in the comfort of my own of my own self like all these big YouTubers like Jacksepticeye usually does. So from what I recall last episode Look we found out Look who hired Joe Chill to kill Thomas and Martha Wayne. And we found out that and we witnessed in that last in last episode like we made like quite a difficult choice between either saving Harvey Denton or Selena Kyle now I chose Selena Kyle I, just to get the two face thing Because I reckon in the, in this episode, that Harvey Dent's gonna be a bad guy for for the next couple of episodes. So that being said, let's dive into episode three, New World Order. Bob and Regina Zeller. So of course I know these two. As a great Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises. I step over from a show called Friends. You can't trust anyone in Gotham. Least of all those you call friend. Your parents learned that the one time was drugged. They're waiting for you in hell. Carmen Falcone. Then I just felt light. Like I could do whatever I wanted. No guilt. No consequence. Your father, Falcone, and I, we had raised... Cobblepot wants retribution because we took his family's land. Your father, Falcone, and I, we had ways of getting anything we wanted. How do you think your family got the land for Wayne Tower? But what would Harvey think? The two of us working together. It's a bit of a tough, 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 tough I can't speak. We should go. It's a tough choice there. Keep on doing what you're doing, and the rest of Gotham will start to see you like I do. A hero. So, so, ladies and gents, as you might have guessed, there's been a change to tonight's program. Uh, we need a new moderator. 
The leader of the you children have nothing of Arkham. To fear. We are the children of Arkham. That was a tough choice there. That was a tough one. I assumed Harvey would win, but not like this. One by default. He's probably pissed he didn't get his landslide fair and square. Hey, Harvey's going to be okay. You don't know that. I just, I keep wondering. Why did you do it? Harvey needed you. Why save me? Harvey's your best friend. I'm nothing to you. I just don't get it. I did it be because I care about you. Well, maybe you shouldn't. I don't think I can do this. What are you talking about? I don't want to see what... I just can't, okay? I have to go. I'm sorry. Just go in without me. I know what you must think of me, but... I can't go in there. I can't look at him and pretend I didn't have anything to do with why he's here. Please, Bruce. Don't tell him I was here. I don't think he'd understand. Gotham is still reeling after last week's mayoral debate. With the drugging and subsequent murder of Mayor Hamilton Hill, Harvey Dent was left running unopposed. After a rather lackluster election, Mayor Dent was sworn in from his hospital bed. Word is, he's still recovering from major hey, injuries Bruce. sustained at the event. So sorry this happened. Hey, come on. Not your fault. Harvey, I am so sorry this happened. Hey, come on. Not your fault. Yeah, well, I'm sorry anyway. I haven't actually seen it yet. You've had me wrapped up this whole time. <laughs> Numbed beyond belief. Maybe it's not that bad. I mean, my family, we heal quick. Could be fine. It's... It's what's on the inside that counts, right? You'll always be beautiful to me, Harvey. <laughs> oh, man. Come on, that's what they tell the girl who doesn't get asked to prom. Yeah, easy. I appreciate the effort, though. Oh, what have you got there? I, uh... <laughs> I brought you some flowers. Though I see I'm not the first. Yeah, well, my mother and my secretary, uh, every sick boy's dream. <laughs> One woman I thought would visit, or at least call, hasn't. Selena's been a no-show. I thought she'd at least come by to congratulate me, if nothing else. Guess we weren't as close as I thought. Guess I can't blame her. The way I look now. She, uh, she was here. What? When? I met her coming in. She said she had to go. Oh. Thanks for letting me know. I am glad you're here, though. God, it's been infuriating. Just sitting here and having nothing but time to think about what happened. I wish I could make myself turn it off completely. Watching footage of the debate over and over. Look at me. Preaching it. What a great guy you are while I go and get my face bashed in. It's easy. Every news station is showing it. Just regurgitating the same old sound bites. I tried to warn you, Harvey. I know, Bruce. Can I say I was stubborn? Everybody paid for it. I was helpless, Bruce. Helpless. Couldn't do anything. Penguin would have just beaten me to death right there in front of everyone. He wanted to. They did to Hill to the moderator. Is a bad idea. I have to live with that. But you heard them up there. But 
penguin and that maniac on screen. Oh, this isn't over. I need to stay ahead of them. They're trying to cause discord. That stunt at the debate was just the first step. That man stopped them from killing you the other night, but they will try again. I won't hide from them, Bruce. But tonight's speech, they'll know where I stand. Wait, wait, wait tonight? I, I thought you were supposed to be recovering. My assistant is on her way to pick me up. With the election, I was able to talk the hospital into releasing me early. <sighs> Not that they're too happy about it. All the doctors keep telling me to take it easy. But how can I? Well, stay in the chair, Mr. Dent. Oh, don't overexert yourself, Mr. Dent. <laughs> yeah, well, you never did play by the rules, did you? Come on, you say that like it's a bad thing. Come on, you do the same in my position. Which is why I won't even try to tell you to not look into those tapes. I know how much you loved your father, Bruce. You know, that debate was hard on you, too. Finding out your dad drugged Esther Cobblepot, Hill admitting to having both of them killed, it's a lot to process. I'm sorry. Just because I keep reliving it doesn't mean you want to. Indeed. Oswald and I were best friends when we were kids. I knew his mother. Talk to her. Uh, look, I, uh, I realize what a terrible friend I've been to you. I was so focused on the campaign, I, I thought distancing myself from you was the only option. I'm sorry. Thanks, Harvey, I appreciate that. I'll make it up to you. What is that? Batman symbol. Coming yeah, from this is the first CCPD. time they actually use it. <laughs> That's one way to get the guy's attention. Already? What else do you have to do? Hey, look, I, I should get going, Harv. What? Already? What else do you have to do? My assistant won't be here for another hour. You can, you can stay if you want. It's uh, it's Alfred. Is he okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He just needs to talk to me. Yeah, of course. Go ahead. Uh, tell the old man I said hi. You, uh... You rest up, Harv. Thanks, Bruce. Batman the Toto series. <coughs> Sorry if I'm coughing a lot. Okay. I haven't had my second drink today. Is it the children of Arkham? Can you confirm? Unit 6 in pursuit of suspects Is it the children of Arkham? Can you confirm? Negative. They're taking shots at us whenever we get close. Understood. Stay on them. We'll we think of something. A little help would be nice. Hang in there, alright? Oh, they knew we'd be there, Jim. We don't have enough officers to deal with this. Look, everyone stretched thin. I'm doing what I can. I have to go. You give me a number to call and rethink my methods. That light has a bad on it, Jim. You give me a number to call, I'll rethink my methods. So I'm just glad I got your attention. I didn't have a lot of options. So, here we are. It's pretty obvious. Says the man dressed like a giant bat. I'd rather have you arrested than come to you for help. But the truth is, we're desperate. I'm calling a truce. Just for tonight. Bring me up to speed. Right. Rene Montoya, one of my officers. The one who tried to shoot me. I know, but hear me out. She's trying to clear her name after those animals manipulated her into killing Falcone. She's supposed to be on leave, but she got a tip on the children of Arkham's chemical stash, went rogue. She's out there alone, and I can't spare anyone to back her up. I told her to wait, but this is personal. The children of Arkham pumped her full of that junk. She went rogue, and you didn't try to stop her. I did what I could, all right? I'm asking for your help. With, with children with, of Arkham are everywhere all of a sudden. With making Where the hell they all come this. from? I never heard of them before. And that debate. Oh, they're tearing up the entire city. 
You want answers? Ask Oswald Cobblepot. Fuck him with my eyesight. It's bring him in for question. To see what the choice is. Gordon here. We've got a problem with the mayor, sir. What happened? Is he okay? I don't know. If I make the wrong choice, it's behind. Christ, one more crisis I can't deal with right now. We've got to keep both Montoya and Dent safe. Probably blame my eyes. I'm on it. You there? Always. Launch the drones. I need eyes on the city. Lucius has made some upgrades. I'll let him explain. Who are you talking to? You got a whole team or something? All right, patching you through to R and D and waiting. My butler. <laughs> yeah, hilarious. All right, patching you through to R and D and Wayne Enterprises. The bad man, so listen. The first model was only equipped for visual surveillance, but seeing how you use them at the skyline, I thought you'd need an audio feed as well. Our microphones are incredibly sensitive. They can pick up sounds from up to 500 yards. In some cases, you'll even be able to hear through walls, like X-ray peering. And why didn't I already have this? Tech upgrades take time. I do run your actual research and development department as well. Any idea where they might be? Montoya's car was spotted crossing the bridge to Arkham Island. Probably headed to his acceptance. Could be where the handoff is happening. Left the hospital, we lost sight of him. What about Dent? They're probably headed to his acceptance speech. They just left the hospital and we lost sight of him. <laughs> Who are we going after? Harvey Dent or Serena? Wait, wait that's um, Montoya. God would <laughs> God my sight is not that good. Let's go with let's go with Harvey Dent. been behind us since the hospital. God, is this guy trying to drive us off the road? What the? Oh, damn it! Headed to the construction site. Send whatever men you can spare after death. I'll round up what officers I can. Gonna have to head out there myself. I know this is risky, Batman. Just be careful. New world order. I don't know how this is going to go. Several armed suspects on the loose. Sorry, man, I've absolutely been partially blind. Like partially sighted. So what it is is like, especially with words, like, like let's say this game over thing. Like, look, I can I can see it, and I can read it, but it's like, it's like, it's like the same word overlap.
got this one. Batman, look out! It's over. Drop the gun. Look, I promise I'm not gonna shoot you, okay? I used to think you were a threat, but I was wrong. We both have much bigger problems right now. I'm sorry. Can you forgive me? Those guys had me pinned down. If you hadn't shown up when you did... I... It's okay. It's in the past. I forgive you. Thank you. It means a lot coming from you. I don't know what I was thinking coming out here alone. I nearly blew it. I could be dead. But you could be dead. And it'd be on me. Good instincts, but you need to think things Indeed. through. Be patient. Don't Indeed. rush. I may not be there to save you next time. Yeah, I owe you big for this one. I still don't understand how they knew I was coming. Dent's in The cops just sent three black and whites to stop our guys going after Dent. For the chatter, sounds like Gordon's with them. Someone's got to help Gordon. They know he's coming. Go. I'll see what I can find here. I'm not giving up on this. Let's go see if Harvey did. Alfred. Are you alright? Yeah. But they knew I was coming. They seemed to be getting info on the GCPD's whereabouts. Not sure how. I need an update on Harvey. Bringing it up now. Debra, get down! Mr. Dent, what did you do to him? I said get back in the car! There's more of them coming! Put down your weapon! There's too many of them! Everybody take cover! You'd better get down there! On my way. Self-defense, he says. New mayor's pretty tough, turns out. Killed one of those guys attacking him with his bare hands. Dent did that? Guess the fellow's lucky Dent got to him before you did, huh? You're right. I wouldn't have let him off that easy. Of course you wouldn't. We got our asses handed to us. They knew you were coming. How? We've been using a secure channel. You saying we got a leak? Yeah. Gordon to command. Anyone, Anyone there? there? Command here. What is it, Gordon? Turn that off. What? It's been compromised. The children of Arkham are listening in on the GCPD's communications. I'm gonna look into this. I'll let you know what I find. The Harvey Dent has like, like, half face mask. It's like he's trying to lie Phantom the Opera. GCPD's been compromised. The children of Arkham were listening the whole time. How? That's what I'm going to find out. Alfred, I'm sending over evidence of some kind of encrypted communication signal. It's coming up on my screen now, but I'm afraid it looks like a bunch of gibberish to me. I need to go to Wayne Tower and look into this. 
Get me Lucius on the line. Yes, right away. If the public finds out the police aren't able to communicate, we'll fix this. We'll fix this. We'll fix this. We'll make it right. We just, just have to stay focused. Because we are strong. I admire your determination, sir. Just be careful, Bruce. I have Lucius on the line now. Bruce, are you there? I'm looking at this data Alfred sent me. It's messy. I have to know what the children of Arkham are doing. How fast can you decrypt? That's a tough one. But I should have it crack soon if you can meet me at Wayne Tower. Already on my way. Wayne Tower. We are back as Bruce. there, Lucius. I'll meet you down in the lab. Some aspects of the children of Arkham surveillance are worrying. Great. Bruce. Chairwoman. I didn't think you'd be here. I was, uh... I used to look to Thomas for guidance in hard times. Must seem silly. After everything that's happened. You know what they say about old habits. I know. Yeah, I, uh, I miss them too. Both of them. Quite a sad I know. Quite Every a sad day, I wish a father was still with us. He was wise beyond his years. And Martha, she was such a delight to have around. I've been called in for an emergency board meeting. I wasn't told invited. You weren't invited, Bruce. You are the topic of discussion for the board. They want to decide what your future at this company will be, whether to dismiss you or not. You have to understand, Bruce. This company is bigger than any one individual. We have to keep face. And after this scandal, I know it must seem like the whole world is turning against you, but I'm not. Bruce, I've got something. You need to get down here, now. I worked with your parents for years, and neither of them gave any indication of foul play. How could you have ever known? Bruce. You're nothing like him, Bruce. We always build up the people closest to us. When they fall, it's a terrible blow to everyone around them. Then go tell that to the board. What do you think I'm trying to do, Bruce? I'm not your enemy. You should remember that. Don't forget who your allies are, Mr. Wayne. I'll come find you after. I'll be right down, Lucius. This is a chess war to look like. <laughs> to get into a back cave. That's quite smart. Imagine having something like that and... Look. And someone wants to play chess with you and it's like and they just accidentally you find out that you that you have a secret layer. That that'd be like absolutely f funny but but quite sus. to hear she's still in your corner. <laughs> Spying on my conversations again? Hey, I'm looking out for you. There have been whispers that the board was going to take action against you. If you lose the company, Batman will take a massive hit too. I know the cave is well equipped, but all of this is owned and paid for by the company. 
You can't afford to lose their resources. It doesn't matter what the board does. We'll be fine. I'm not gonna let anything get in the way of what we're doing, Dust. Try saying that when you can't access this wing anymore. Right now, finding out how the children of Arkham are spying on the police is more important. What have you got? It's Wayne Tech, Bruce. As you know, Wayne Enterprises is a telecommunications giant. If someone were to, say, uh, build a back door into that tech... You're telling me the children of Arkham hacked into this system? So that's the thing. Do you want the good news or the bad news? Uh, you're not gonna like it. <laughs> there's good news? The children of Arkham are accessing the Wayne Enterprises network. I can't imagine there's a bright side. Eye of the beholder, Bruce. The good news is, I should be able to shut down the back door. But that's because I was the one who built it. You? What are you talking about? When your mission is back on started, you needed a way to monitor the city. Well, this is how. I piggyback Batman's surveillance onto Wayne Enterprise's signal. If the children of Arkham have access to the same system, does that mean they know my identity? It looks like they've only accessed the GCPD so far. Not a lot of activity otherwise. Yeah. I'll have Alfred warn Gordon. The GCPD needs to get rid of their Wayne Tech devices. Smart move. I've encrypted our access. I can fortify it, but it's going to take longer to force them out of the system. I've encrypted our access. I can fortify it, but it's going to take longer to force them out of the system. The question remains. How did the children of Arkham find out about the back door in the first place? They shouldn't have been able to find it. Not unless they knew what they were looking for. Whoever broke in certainly knew how to cover their tracks. I'll try to keep an eye out for any suspicious activity. Maybe they'll get sloppy and give themselves away. I'm gonna keep working on this children of Arkham business. See if there's a way to shut down their access entirely. We'd better lock this stuff down, just in case. Let's look at the impact tech. So, what's this? Something I'm still working on. Some new armament to assist you in the field. Ooh, what's this? Uh, something I'm so still working on. Like Some new armament to assist you in the field. Quieter. There's only so much you can do on your own. Man, I'd love to see that. I but it's not really like ready yet. Get, I'd, love, I'd love to see that get used in like the, in like the third season of this game. That's if it gets announced. That's if the game. That's if the game franchise gets a third season. Thermal vision. <laughs> You've been Just busy, you haven't you, with this? If, if you haven't noticed, it's like Telltale or, 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 or Skybound. And there's like an unannounced game coming. I always wonder why you had a table that could hide itself. Yes, it's coming in okay, pretty soon now. From the Trust me, or from among us two. it's much more paranoia than precaution. We've got like an unannounced game, which could either be in The Walking Dead Season 5, or it could be in Batman Telltale Season 3. But only time will tell. I'm not sure I'll ever get the first one back from Selena. <laughs> <laughs> she probably stole my dignity. Wonder if that's the only thing she stole. I'm just kidding. It just picks it up and puts it down. And if you, if you can hear like any background noise, try to ignore it as per usual. Probably won't be able to hear it as Tiffany. Uh, Tiffany's really taking after you. And Luke, stubborn as always. I think of what Gotham has become. And I think of them. They give me all the reason I need to work with Batman. He's the only one that will truly protect them. And he will, Lucius. Always. So, anything new? This is gonna take some time. Don't worry. I'll let you know when I find something. Mayor Harvey Dent gave a rousing speech late last night.
last night, refuting claims that the children of Arkham were Newly elected mayor Harvey Dent gave a rousing speech late last night, refuting claims that the children of Arkham were gaining control in Gotham. Despite his run-in with the masked group on the way to the event, people are still hopeful that Mayor Dent can pull through on his campaign promises. Who are the children of Arkham really fighting for? Who is Batman really protecting? Because it's not us. It's time that we, not masked vigilantes and violent fringe groups, fought for ourselves. I will fight every day for Gotham. And I ask that you join me. We are proud citizens of Gotham. And this is our city. Next up, we speak to Commissioner Grogan regarding increased security measures citywide. A new sticky bomb I developed. The signal is activated on the underside. Attach it wherever you need, then detonate it remotely with your gauntlet. Boom. Nice. Be careful. Those things pack a serious punch. Not sure what else we're supposed to do here. Look at this part, so... like another invaluable piece of Lucius Fox technology. There we go, found it. <sighs> Looks like Regina's headed to my office. I should go. Now before you do... Here. Get that back to the bat computer. It'll install the added security measures. You'll also have all the info I found on the children of Arkham's activity within the system. Thanks, Lucius. I've always got your back, yeah, Batman. Right. Now get out of here. This is a cool guy. Regina doesn't like to be kept waiting. And he is voiced by a cool guy. Maybe you've left. Yeah, right. Well, the board has voted. And have they sent the chairwoman to wield the axe? Yeah. You're being asked to step down from your position as CEO. Effective immediately. At least until this whole mess gets cleaned up. I get it. My name isn't great for business lately. I'm sorry, Bruce. It's not your fault. I asked to slow all this down, but... The press release is going out as we speak. I'm sorry, Bruce. There will be a public event in the morning where you will formally announce your resignation. I'm sorry, Bruce. I tried to fight for you. The board believes this is the only logical course of action. I see where they're coming from. I appreciate the I really appreciate you trying, Regina. Thanks. Don't mention it. Our stock is tanking. The board is losing confidence. Wayne Enterprises needs a new face. They already had a candidate in mind. I thought it was... <clears throat> I was outvoted. Remember, he'd only be interim CEO. Just until this mess gets cleared up. 
And who would that be? Oswald, are you serious? Oswald Cobblepot. Bruce, old boy. Good to see you again. As you know, Oswald's parents were, well, victims of your father's actions. This company As you know, Oswald's parents were, well, victims of your father's actions. This company was built on the land he stole from the Cobblepot family. Well, the board thought having me step in would be a good PR move. What better way to show Gotham that Wayne Enterprises is committed to righting the wrongs of the past? Happy to help any way I can. People aren't much behind the Wayne name now. And considering that your parents stole from mine, Cobblepot sits easier on the tongue. This is a joke, right? You're not qualified to run a company. Like an old film. Now, Bruce, is that any way to treat an old friend? I'm just trying to help. The board has complete confidence in Mr. Cobblepot. As his resume goes into great detail, his endeavors in England have been quite successful. Besides, the company basically runs itself at this point. The CEO is mostly a figurehead. Don't make this harder than it has to be. I refuse to hand my company over to a criminal. Don't do this, Bruce. Oh, don't worry now. I'm going to take good care of this place. I'm afraid we need you to leave the building immediately. We'll have your personal effects sent to you. Congratulations, Bruce. I couldn't be prouder of you. Congratulations, Bruce. I couldn't be prouder of you. Alfred. Oh, how sweet. Graduation present. Surely we could let him take us along. I really want to punch him, bro. Oh, Bruce. Clumsy, clumsy. No wonder you're not being trusted with oh, fuck, fuck anymore. Fuck it. I'll call someone in to clean that up. Fuck it. It'll only take a minute. Oh, Bruce and I can handle it. No trouble. Right, Bruce. <laughs> Bruce! I need security in here right now. Oh, for oh what was that? This is a disaster. You've lost your bloody mind. Bruce, yeah, stop I'm this. Bastard. Oh, for heaven's sake, calm That's down. Do. What's gotten into you? <sighs> Get him out of my office. Let's I'm go. I'm so sorry, Mr. Cobblepot. I'll go fetch the medic. That's very kind of you, Regina. Thank you. I know y'all wanted to see me like he like actually try and punch him, but like Bruce, so, might they I think when this I to first you? played this, this game, isn't over yet. I, didn't punch him, so. I took care of it. This is like an ultimate play. Can't find out what's down there, Bruce. Think you can keep an eye on while I'm there are ways they could get in. You know that. Think you can keep an eye on things while I'm gone? I... I don't know. Lucius... I need to know there's someone I can trust on the inside. I'm here for you, Bruce. I've always been here for you. Not them. If I stay, I'll have to stop working on our... Psy project. That means no new tech, no repairs if you need them. I... could keep an eye on things for you. Let you know what they're up to. Feed you what information I can. But come work for me. It won't be what you have here, but at least we can keep pace on the new we pretty much need to I'll go and office. gather what I can from the lab. Thanks, Lucius. We pretty much need him to, to work for us. Keep that drive safe. on the issue at a press event tomorrow morning where we'll learn more about his decision to step down more on that in a moment i still can't believe it which part i wish life were easier for you bruce it's just one thing after another yeah i wouldn't mind easy for a change someday
<clears throat> uh, Lieutenant Gordon. He said there's nothing to be done about Oswald Cobblepot. All his records are spotless. He needs proof to dig further. Penguin Slippery, all right. With the children of Arkham accessing Wayne Tech, I have to figure out what their next move is. Bring up a searchable network of all possible electronic traffic related to Wayne Enterprises. If the children of Arkham are in our system, all of this is potentially accessible. All of this? Lucius was very thorough. It means that they could have eyes and ears into almost everything in Gotham. Just like Batman. They had access to the GCBD, we know that. The real question is, what else they'd be interested in? Filter for possible targets based on known Children of Arkham activity. Patients committed to Arkham going back 20 years. A rather extensive list. With my father's signature as the transferring doctor. Security footage. These date back decades. Alfred, the video at the debate. It's real. This is how they found their evidence. Something Hill did gave them access. At least now I know the truth. No, I... Yes. Yes, I know it takes time, but... statement of the century. Considering I've got at least one of my guys in the ER. Yes. Just please let me know when it happens. The children of Arkham aren't going to wait on us. I suppose I can understand the truth of that. Harvey has no idea. It's impossible to tell if the children of Arkham have access to this, but if they do, any action he takes against them, they'll see coming. Are you done here, sir? seen enough. I have to go warn Harvey. Keep an eye on this, Alfred, and have Lucius look into it as well. We need to find a way to lock them out. Very good, sir. <laughs> I've been looking forward Which to this my entire do. career. The day Harvey Dent takes his official portrait that someone of else Gotham. dies. Yeah, that sort of thing. And he looks like this. Glad you survived the trip up here, Bruce. You want to tell me what's going on? I didn't keep you waiting that long, did I? I have reason to believe you're being watched. You sound paranoid, Bruce. The children of Arkham are hacking into the GCPD. They're likely keeping tabs on you, too. I'll handle it. Thank you, Bruce. Damn it! I was just 
children of ours and jump me. God, it's only getting worse. It's out of control. I can't stop it. I heard Batman showed up to help. Yeah, not too late. Harvey Dent does everything by the book. Yeah, we to the letter of the law. Here we That's go. Working. Uh, sure. Uh, Turning uh, things around. Barely. Slowly. I'd like to see you do better. Watch me. Yeah. Now are you gonna fix this mess? Simple. Easy. Curfews after dark. Checkpoints in every. You're acting strange. Harvey. This whole city's acting strange. Damn. Sorry. Sorry about that, Bruce. I guess I got a little lost there. I'm probably not getting enough sleep these days. You definitely need to stress. see a doctor. It's just the stress. I think you should go see a doctor, Harvey. The way you're behaving, it's not healthy. Yeah, I have a guy's number. I'll uh, I'll see him as soon as I have time. Uh, Mr. Dent. The photographer's ready for you. Thank you, Deborah. I'll be right out. Please, Bruce. Don't tell anyone about this. If anyone finds out or thinks I'm not fit to be mayor, it's all over. Everything I've worked for. I've never seen this side of you, Harvey. And I sure as hell don't like it. Can I still trust you? <sighs> See you around, Bruce. Well, at least we know what Harvey Dent is like now. He's both the, the mayor and a villain. An interview with the children of Arkham's leader. A potential villain. I wonder how Vicky managed to score that. Bruce? Uh, have you seen today's copy of the Gazette? It just arrived a moment ago. It seems Miss Vale has been talking to some very interesting people. People the Batman would like to find. Do you think she would be willing to help you? She may be the only lead we have on the children of Arkham's leader. And she could be persuaded to reveal her source. Last time we talked, I gave her a pretty valuable tip. Sergeant Montoya's name. Though yeah. after this interview, I'm sure the police will become suspicious of all of Miss Bale's sources. And if they find out you leaked Montoya's name... True. We need to be careful. I can't yeah. afford to waste time with Vicky. Let's offer her a chat with Batman. Good idea, sir. Can you scramble the line? Right away. Bill. I saw your story in the Gazette this morning. I want to talk. Who... who is this? Batman. Hello? Batman. I didn't realize that Batman was a fan of my work. I didn't say I was a fan. Just said I wanted to talk. I've been meaning to thank you. What you did at the debate. I'm not sure I would have made it out of there otherwise. I'd say I owe you one. Meet me at sundown. Cobblepot Park. Deal. wasn't sure you were going to show. Had to admit, part of me thought it was a prank call. There are safer options out there. Why here? <laughs> Seems topical. So, <laughs> Batman, I'll skip the obvious question. The children of Arkham seem to be your latest target. We all know their methods are extreme, but what about their message? Their leader claims that Gotham's elite have been abusing their power, often at the expense of ordinary citizens. For the record, 
Do you think there's any validity to what they're saying? In your opinion. You saw what they did at the debate. They're terrorizing Gotham. That's yeah. all there is to it. They yeah, terrorized. Some say they're liberating it. And you believe that? Well, it doesn't matter what I believe. I just report the facts. Their message is picking up traction. Especially since the interview. I need to know everything they told you. Does no one read anymore? <sighs> it was a lot of posturing and grandiose monologuing, really. We're going to purge the city of corruption sort of thing. Not great from an investigative standpoint, but the public will eat it up. Part of the job, you know? If that's the only reason you called me, you should really just read it yourself. They aren't trying to hide their motivations. It's all out there. Clear as day. Gotham needs to know how dangerous the children of Arkham really are. You are hiding the truth. Huh. My editor says the physical copies are practically sold out. I'd say the truth is getting out there. It just may not be the side you like. But that's why I'm here. To get the other half I'm missing. Where did you meet? How did they contact you? Yeah, okay, I'm gonna stop you right there. I'm not selling out a source. Not even for Batman. The circumstances of that meeting are confidential. Just like this one. I'm sure you wouldn't want me telling everyone how to get a hold of you. You were putting the safety of everyone in Gotham at risk. Well, if you really care about the safety of Gotham, why aren't you looking at Bruce Wayne? I still want to believe he's a good guy too, but... With the information that surfaced, everyone's angry. Everyone wants him to answer for what his family did. Everyone. Except for you. Why haven't you gone after him yet? No way, he just slipped some under secret the radar. Hip. But so far, no action from you I mean, against Batman. him. No investigation. Why is that? I'm not here to talk about Bruce Wayne. Look, I came here to meet you. I didn't have to do that. I don't know if you have some connection with him. Maybe there's more to this story than I realize. But you can't ignore the facts. Whether he intended to or not, his family has been stealing from innocent people for years. So, what are you going to do about it? What is Batman doing to protect them from Bruce Wayne? The people want to know. That's enough questions. <sighs> Fine. If that's how you Good luck with the children of Arkham. I think that was enough questions though. I'll be sure your message gets out. Please, Miss Vale. Think what you want about Bruce Wayne. But I need to find the children of Arkham before they hurt anyone else. Then you should have taken my deal. If you're as good as they say you are, I'm sure you'll find a way. Batman is such a top. Lose my job for this, but here, this is where you we always met tell us over people. Please don't tell anyone I gave this to you. Which I guess that's what I'd be doing if, if like, if, like, if I was, was like, like in this same situation with, with Sia. By the way, on if you're watching this. You are the cutest person ever. Investigate. 
He's been dead for a while from the looks of it. One of the children of Arkham. Loyalty doesn't get you much with these people, does it? Seems strange. There's something else. He was shot dead center. Twice. Executed. It outlived his usefulness, I suppose. This man's veins. They look like Montoya's veins after she was drugged, only... They're so much worse. The same drug from the debate. I feared we hadn't seen the last of it. There's no puncture mark here. No entry point for an injection. So, how did it get in his body? They've been referencing the map. Whatever they're building must hinge on it somehow. This depot is pretty centrally located. A detonation device, but it's disabled. They must have intended to hook it up to something. The timer is set for 27 minutes and 13 seconds. From now? The numbers aren't moving. Doesn't seem to be counting down yet. This is how they were timing their route. Alfred, what stations are within a 27-minute train ride from this depot? Looking into the transportation database now. Sir, there's just one. Mercy Street Station. It's one of the busiest places in the city. Thousands of people go in and out every hour. These barrels match the shrapnel that I found at the docks. See if there's anything around here. Someone's been practicing chemistry. This solvent increases dermal permeability. Looks like they ran out of the absorbing agent. Something spilled here. This is the drug they've been using. Refined. It's the same as the one given to Montoya and Harvey. This train car has been modified. How do you mean? Clearly the holding tank. It's empty. For now. Easy access. The train car was raised to make working beneath it easier. They wanted to get this done fast. Looks like some kind of sprinkler system. Doubtful they're planning to put out fires. The train car is their delivery system. Maximum coverage. Hmm. This doesn't add up. to know where their target is.
traces of both chemicals here. The drug is being modified here. They're changing it. must have found a way to weaponize it. With a drug that can absorb into skin, it will affect hundreds of people at once. They're loading the modified drug into the tank on the train, dispersing it through the sprinklers. The timers are set to go off just as it rolls in over the crowds. We are prepared to contain something of that scale. Releasing a drug like that in so populated an area would be devastating. They could infect the entire city if they had enough. Good thing you reduced their supply at the construction site. Thankfully, there wasn't enough of the chemical to mix with the rest of the stockpile of drugs. There's a train coming. Take cover. Here comes the train. The question is, who is on that train? The leader. The leader of the children of Arkham. If I'd known you were going to make me lug this thing myself, I would have worn more comfortable shoes. And Catwoman. Just add it to the list of your mistakes. Must be why you didn't come through on your last assignment. Hmm. I really like the Children of Arkham's leader's voice. We're down to our last few barrels since Batman screwed up the transfer. We have to make do, I guess. Look, it's like very demonic almost. It almost hey, reminds me of Diamond Get Head mixed, from the classic the series. This way. Their leader is here. The Catwoman. Catwoman. She's got more of that absorbing agent. She must have a good reason for being there. Doesn't sound like she's too happy to be here. We're done here, right? Not yet. No, 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 no. There's no part two of this. I got what you wanted. I'm done. You might as well come out, Batman. I know you're here. No way. I did not bring him here. I honored our deal. Oh, I know you did. But now, you're a loose end. Surrender. Unless you'd like to see firsthand what a critical dose looks like. She joined poor Esther Cobblepot. Death might be preferable. I surrender. Take me instead, and let her go. Now screw this. I'm not that sort of damsel. Train's ready! Move out! Fire. 
We're just here to stoke the flames. Saddest thing is, they don't even see the smoke. The people of Gotham are stronger than you think. Oh, they won't let this up. city fall into chaos. You'd be surprised. Fear can be incredibly persuasive. Go on. I, I doubt it can be. Show me how to save your precious city. I doubt it can be quite motivating or persuasive. Just like that. <laughs> and stuff like facial expressions let's try this again nope still failed we'll get that, we'll get that we will get past this part like we did, like we did last episode Scene in this 
this episode is probably gonna happen. Stay here, okay? Just don't move. Don't leave. I'm just getting something from the other room. You're gonna be okay, Bruce. You were wearing that suit. You know that was stupid, right? Uh, yeah, I know it's like a video game, what? but showing up at that train depot, taking on their leader alone. <sighs> Repeat yeah. after me, Bruce. I am not invincible. It's quite and painkillers do not solve the problem. And, and I pretty you much weren't gonna take them down on your own. I pretty much skip. They would have killed you. If I see it. <laughs> You're one to talk. I never pick a fight I can't win. I don't think you're getting very far with a shoulder like this. Oh, great. You can stay here until morning. I feel like I owe you anyway. That's twice now. You just keep adding things to my list, don't you? Selena. I told you I don't like owing people. Probably best to look low for now anyway. I'm probably gonna have to the scene. Then with the children of Arkham find this place. Because YouTube doesn't really... Doesn't really like... I had like, a handle, you know. Doesn't really leader. like loot. I had a plan. Really didn't need you swooping in and messing it up. I was just trying to help you, Selena. I didn't ask for your help. <laughs> well, I didn't ask for yours either, but here we are. Touché. That was gonna be my ticket out of here. Cause like I don't want One my, job to get I, my want, off my I don't want so my content to get age restricted. Thanks again, Bats. In like mini canes in its videos. You could just leave. So a lot of the furry content I watch. Come on. Tired of starting over, I guess. Oh, look who's back. Hey, little one. I don't think she likes you. <laughs> okay, she really doesn't like you. Hey, I promise I don't bite. Yeah, but she does. T cut it out. This really hasn't been your week, has it? You think? I lost my company, my reputation, and I find out my father was... Just like everyone else. They've all got something to hide, Bruce. Every last one of them. Even the so-called good guys. There's always something just beneath the surface. You're wrong. There are good people out there. Honest people. Care to introduce me to one? Yep, but me. Come on, Bruce. Even you have your I'm... secrets. Unfortunately, and, and those things you hide from the world, luckily I am and taken. won't let anyone else see. Well, the difference is, my secret doesn't hurt anybody. Then you're better than most. You're a good man, Bruce. But good men don't lie with thieves. I know what I am. Yeah. No noble intentions. Just the thrill of breaking what they say can't be broken. Knowing there's no safe I can't crack. No fortress I can't infiltrate. Proving I can. I'm never really sure if I can trust you. Can't say I blame you for that. I've stolen from corrupt jerks like Hill, but... I've taken plenty from good people, too. For what? Some shiny new toys in a crappy apartment on the edge of town? The high is nice, but... It wears off. Then you look around and see... Nothing. So you get back out there. Try and chase that feeling down. It's not the same, but... I know what you mean. After everything we do, everything we're capable of, coming home just feels... Like a disappointment. Right.
Looks like guys, this is our show 99 here. Yeah, from the future, but I'm telling you, letting you know that this scene was censored because see, it was too lewd and not safe for work for YouTube. So I've censored it and muted this scene's audio. If you are enjoying this video, be sure to like and subscribe. Anyways, on with with the video. No. No, I don't. No, I don't. Sorry, I must have misread things. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know that this is a video I game, thought... but never mind. Let me go get you a blanket. Yeah, I get it. I get it. She's hot, but... At least she's not hissing at you anymore. Hooray for small miracles. I don't know, I'm bisexual, but I'm more on the... on the gay side. Another drink? Currently. No, I'm fine. Never run into anyone else who did this, you know? You can't be Batman all the time. So what's a night off look like? What do you do when you take off the mask? Well, according to Alfred, I don't get out enough. You two are close, huh? Indeed. Must be nice. You don't have any more like that? I did. But that was a long time ago. I guess this is good night then. Good night, Selena. Glad that's glad that scene's out of the way. Hopefully. Hopefully we can find some good info about about Selena Carlos, please. Hopefully we can find that grapple gun as well. Morning, Alfred. Oh, thank goodness. I was worried. I hadn't heard from you. I didn't know what happened if, if you were... I uh, took a bit of a beating when I ran to the children of Arkham. What happened? It's kind of a long story. I'll tell you about it when I get back. I always fear the day you don't come home, Bruce. I know, Al. Where are you, anyway? I, uh, I stayed at Selena's last night. Uh, oh. <laughs> Nothing happened. I never said it did. While you're there, this might be a good opportunity to learn more about Miss Kyle. After all, we really don't know anything about her. I was just so thinking can find that. lying around. If she's trustworthy, you may not have another chance. I was just thinking that. I'm not going to go snooping around in her personal belongings. I understand. Merely a suggestion. At the very least, you can find that grapple gun of yours. Right. It might be harder than you'd think. She doesn't share your love of organization. Yes, well, I'll see you back at home, Bruce. Scarlet Pimpernel, much ado about nothing. <laughs> Truck, uh, hmm. Didn't take her for a romantic. What's this one? Oh. The Guido Govinda. That's academic. Look, 
looks like I got a new toy to play with. I think I should take it. There you are. You know, I hope she didn't break anything. There it is. I will take it back. <sighs> Vacation spots or just marks on her burglary checklist? and cream cheese. I really could go for something like that right now. Probably might, probably might, like, probably might get one of those, uh, probably might get one after, like after this video. Well, looks alright to me. Nothing growing at least. Who's at the door? That, that cat. Hey, I, I, have, I brought breakfast. Harvey Dent. Can I come in? I don't know if that's such a good idea. Just, just for a minute. I really need to talk to you. Stay hidden. If you want me to go, I'll go. But I have to get this out. <laughs> Damn cat. Bruce? What the... Seriously? What are you doing here? Have a seat, Harvey. No! I don't need to sit down. Bruce, tell me what is going on. I just came by to check on Selena. What, with your pants off? Back off, Harvey. Don't! Don't touch me! I thought I would come here and... So stupid! God, I should have known. I should have known that you would do this to me! Not if it was real anyway. God, how could you ever think it was? I should have come. So stupid! Harvey, nothing happened, I promise you. No, you don't have to answer to him. He... He will not be able to protect you. And I don't need him to. Just... Get out of here, Harvey. What happens when the children of Arkham come for him? You think you won't get caught in the crossfire? You can't stop them! He can't. I believe Selena asked you to leave. Not that easy. Leaving. Harvey couldn't get me to do it either. I'm not going anywhere! I'm sorry. What the hell is going on with you? Up until now, Harvey has been weak. He's been afraid. Oh my god. There you go. This... This is the monster they all know that you are. Embrace it! Oh. No! No! Oh god, this is what you wanted to see, isn't it, huh? The freak! Harvey. Right now you've got two seconds. Or what? Harvey won't be pushed around anymore. No, he's gonna make them pay. Everyone who thought they could hurt him and get away with it. Starting with you. Both of you! You're gonna pick that up. Who am I? Yes, you are. I'm high. Like or I could just throw you out myself. Your choice. <laughs> Flip for it. This isn't funny. No, no, it really isn't. Selena, looks like you're first. 
Take him out. Have you lost your mind? No. Harvey! You need to calm down. What are you doing? No going back now. Come on, Harvey, that's enough. Talking about. There's no one else here. It's, it's no one. It's just me. My fault. Harvey, don't. Bruce, I. I don't think we can help him. Not on our own. It's just me. It's just me. It's just me. It's just me. I think maybe you're right. There's nothing we can do for him now. Poor Let me call someone. I'll. I'll go. I know I messed it all up. You don't have to go off with your tail between your legs. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Harvey! <sighs> so much for this place. I'm not gonna stick around and wait for him to come back. I thought it would be a while before I had to move again. That's what I get for wishful thinking. You're just gonna take off. Where will you go? I don't know. Not a lot of apartments in Gotham with this kind of private access. Ugh. Maybe I'll live on a boat. <laughs> Kidding. Kenny from The Walking Dead would be yeah. proud. That means you too. We won't go far. Don't worry. You should come stay with me. I don't know. There's plenty of space. Alfred could set up a guest room for you. I'll think about it. <laughs> Great, now I've got... Now I've got... Great. Oh, oh God, is an awesome God. Stuck I'm yet. supposed to announce my resignation at a press event today. Somehow try to appear happy that Oswald so the that I said Kenny would be proud. Sounds like an opportunity. How do you mean? They screwed you out of your own company. You have all this information that could bring them down, and they're handing you a live mic. So use it. Don't be their puppet. Maybe you're right. Yeah, maybe you're right. This could be my chance to expose Oswald for who he really is. Let Gotham know he's a part of the children of Arkham. Exactly. Oh, so what's a bad you better dude. get going. I've got hey. some packing to do. The offer still stands. Sounding and, better and, and better criminals by the can't run Wayne and Wayne Enterprises. They cannot. I think we're approaching the end of the episode. So. So I wonder how how they, this will go. I'm sorry about all this, Bruce. We've uh, we've prepared a brief damage control statement to make this easier. After I introduce you, all you'll have to do is read what's on the teleprompter, and then I can take it from there. 
Got my little coronation speech just waiting. And please, Bruce, try to be on your best behavior. The very best. Wouldn't want to bring any more shame to the Wayne family name. Now would we? Um, what is on my best behavior? Trust me. I, I know it's unfair to ask this child. of you. But please, or the golden floof. right now, your reputation, your entire legacy, depends on your cooperation. Get through today, and I can help you. I can convince the board to bring you back. Of course, Regina. Whatever I can do to help. That's good, Bruce. Trust us to sort this all out. Everything will be fine. Bruce, what's your opinion of the Shire? Regina wanted me to cover it up with... Makeup. She doesn't think it looks very dignified. She still but has that. Here, I think it's a fine display of what the moral high ground looks like. She Mr. Still has the bruise. All in good fun, honestly. <laughs> a thrown punch is just water under the bridge, right, Bruce? <laughs> boys are just being boys and all of that. No hurt feelings, I'm sure. Sorry for hitting you, Oswald. It was wrong. Uh, uh I. Thank you, Bruce. I appreciate you being such a professional. It's time. Bruce, I'm going to introduce you and then you're on. Please, stick to the teleprompter. Good morning, everyone, and thank you for being here. Wayne Enterprises has always taken its role in the community very seriously. Isn't it funny how everything I said to you in the park has come true? Me, taking everything that's yours. Then it's not even a punchline. <laughs> oh dear. Not even close. No one's gonna follow you around and take pictures now. It'd always be sad if you were so bloody handsome. The children of Arkham handed you this coup, Oswald. You didn't earn any of it. Damn right. Who cares? It never really matters how a king comes to sit on his throne, Bruce. The only thing that matters is that it's his bum warm in the chair. This is just a first step towards making things right. Soon enough, it'll be Cobblepot Industries, Cobblepot Medical, and Cobblepot Tech on tops of buildings, and you, Waynes, will be what you should have been all along. A forgotten footnote. Cobblepot will come to mean the future of Gotham. That is not going to happen. Oh, don't be a sore loser, Bruce. It doesn't look nice on you. Oh, I forgot to mention, I did some digging. And you know how Old Hill admitted he had your mom and dad killed? I found out why he did it. Oh, yeah. And I'll tell you the story, but only if you say, pretty please. It's, it's quite the page, Turner. I'm sure you'll just die and to hear it. You know I don't need to know why. Hill had them killed. That's all that matters. Well, I certainly didn't expect that. Well, suit yourself. Now you'll never know what part your mum played in it. And now, Bruce Wayne to would like Martha to say a few words. Remember, Perfect enjoy yourself, Bruce. After all, you never know how much time you really have left. First, I'm gonna read this teleprompter. A bit of it. Ladies and gentlemen, and then I'll expose in light of recent allegations against my family, I have decided to voluntarily step down as CEO of Wayne Enterprises. My father wasn't the only one involved in this corruption. Mayor Hill and Carmine Falcone. It was a system designed for their gain. Dodging the blame? Is it gonna do you any good, mate? One moment, folks. Try that again, and I'll call security. I have complete faith in the board as they work towards righting the wrongs of the past. Mr. Wayne, are you having trouble reading the teleprompter? My replacement, Oswald Cobblepot, is a member of the Children of Arkham. They control his every move. Security! Tell him, Bruce. Step back, Mr. Wayne. It was quite a show you put on, Bruce. 
My apologies, folks. Please forgive me, Mr. Everyone. I, for one, completely understand his behavior. Nice statement. The press seemed to eat it up. I rather enjoyed it myself. We can talk about it later. Later? No. This needs to happen right now. Fuck you, fam. Dropped your pen. It's not. <coughs> she, she stabbed me with a pen. What was it? What was it? You feel that? That's the drug taking hold of you. How could you? Retribution, Bruce. See, kids, that's why you don't. That's why you don't stab people with pens. That it can be quite venomous. Look at him up there, taking everything that should belong to you, mocking you, a smug, insignificant bastard. He thinks he can get away with it, because none of them know who he really is. They wouldn't believe you if you told them. And if we could just get one more round of applause for our friend, the man of the hour, Bruce Way! Oh my god, the choice is over. <laughs> Messed up because of the truck. <laughs> Ouch, someone's a little touchy, it seems. It would be so easy to get rid of him. Who else will deliver justice? <sighs> well, at least, at least we now know. I guess we now know who the leader of the of the children of Arkham is. Vicky Vale is the main villain. And she is Lady Arkham. I forgot to mention that this this game series, like this, this season, like like it introduced like its own villain, like Lady Arkham isn't in like any of the comics, so any of them like DC media. Delta really made like 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 their own like unique felon there's like Harvey Dent slash Two-Face like, like he's pretty much a, a DC villain in, and like in the comics it's and the game So there's all my choices there. If you didn't like any of the choices, feel free to to like look. Uh, I'm trying not to to hate to look like any of the choices that are made in this in this episode. Try to keep the comments like positive, like positive vibes all round.
see what, what, what might happen in episode 4. I'm curious to, to what will happen next. Next time on the Batman Telltale series. After his shocking and atrocious display of violence towards Oswald Cobblepot and members of the press, Bruce Wayne has demonstrated a clear lack of mental stability. That is why, regrettably, I made the decision to have my old friend hospitalized in Arkham Asylum. Batman, the Damn. children of Arkham, the Penguin. Doesn't Gotham already have enough deranged criminals terrorizing its streets? So Bruce is now it. I believe that Gotham citizens in, deserve to be oh, safe. God. That they deserve to be protected. Alfred has a gun in the Even next episode. I have to do it myself. So it looks With the like next episode, Harvey Dent and we need him now more and than ever. Where is well, Harvey Dent and Alfred are probably gonna have a, a, a gun shoot out. There's the comics. We all know about the comics, so. So yeah, uh, that was that was episode three. The World Order of the Batman Telltale series. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, comment below what you thought of this video. And hopefully. Like hopefully I'll do more of these like soon and hopefully make them come in like quality in you know, like better quality. And hopefully I'll be able to make stuff like like better live streams and and hopefully more VR chat uh, slash VR content. Such as VR chat, Beat Saber, Half Life Alex, and much more. So, that being said, I hope you enjoyed the, the video, and I'll see you guys in the next video.